Our world, our experience, is being transformed by data. Artificial intelligence, machine learning, predictive analytics, neural networks, these aren't technologies of tomorrow. They're here today, analyzing, modeling, predicting, and discovering, uncovering deeper, more human insights, and enriching life's experiences. And it's all made possible with Micron. Our memory and storage is at the foundation of this data transformation, storing the data generated by practically every type of smart device and high-speed computer on the planet, and pushing processing to the next level. 2.5 quintillion bytes per day, every day, and growing exponentially. An infinite torrent of data. We're turning information into insight and activating data to reach higher realms of productivity and innovation. Welcome to Micron Technology, where we transform how the world uses information to enrich life for all. Backed by over 40 years of business technology leadership, Micron is a world leader in innovating memory and storage solutions that accelerate the transformation of information into intelligence, inspiring the world to learn communicate and advance faster than ever. Micron has grown into a global semiconductor juggernaut employing 40,000 people across 17 countries with approximately 8,000 team members in Singapore. Our Singapore site serves as Micron Technologies headquarters for our worldwide operations and is home to our largest manufacturing footprint. Singapore is also Micron's designated Man Centre of Excellence driving the implementation of companies' leading-edge 3D NAND production for use in mobile, automotive, client, consumer and data centre applications. Hi everyone, my name is Mini and I will be your host for today's virtual tour in Micron. I joined Micron as a workforce development engineer since I graduated from NUS Chemical Engineering back in 2019. My team provides training solutions to enhance the technical capabilities of our team members and as the program owner for our new hire training, I enjoy shaping the onboarding experience for our new hires as well as interacting with them. One thing that I love about Micron is how we can always anticipate exciting innovation coming from the team here. Micron Singapore is one of the first factories in Singapore to be recognised for innovation and sustainability by the World Economic Forum Global Lighthouse Network. And on top of that, Micron's 176-layer NAND, the world's most technologically advanced NAND, is produced and assembled here in Singapore. These awards and recognition in innovation are made possible with Micron's value of people. Micron achieved 7th place in the 2020 Singapore Great Place to Work for medium and large workplaces and was part of the top 15 for Singapore's 100 leading graduate employers in 2020. I'm also proud to share that Micron houses the highest number of women engineers in Singapore across all Micron sites worldwide. Joining me today is Leonard, Shami and Binita will also be sharing with you interesting aspects of their experiences in Micron. Now, we are located here in Micron's Fat 10N site, one of the three Micron sites in Singapore. Our diverse workforce is made up of about 8,000 team members from 30 nationalities. And our site area can fit in more than two Marina Bay Sands. Our 300mm wafer fat also houses a state-of-the-art clean room which is truly fascinating. Without further ado, let's take a look at what Micron Singapore produces here. Technology. It makes us think of numbers, data analytics and math. All the stuff that goes in your head. But the truth is, the head is powerless if not fueled by the heart. And memory is the heart of technology. The driving force that pumps life into every product application and innovation it touches. Our automated material handling system works tirelessly transporting cassettes of silicon wafers. 
Individual memory chips or die are built upon pure silicon wafer in the wafer fabrication facility. Fabs are state-of-the-art clean room that are 100 times cleaner than a hospital operating room to ensure silicon wafers are protected from ambient contamination. Each wafer may be moved more than a thousand processes and it takes more than one month to produce a memory chip. In Micron, we introduced and linked sensors like cameras and acoustic sensors to gather even more data that allows us to further improve our production processes using the very technology that Micron produces as we deploy smart manufacturing, AI solutions at scale in our factories. Upon completion of the processing in FAB, wafers are moved to probe, where initial functionality test is performed on each die on the wafer. Probe card positions probe needles on each die to send and receive test data. This information are used to generate a map of all the dies on the wafers and only good dies will continue in the manufacturing process. Wafers are first thin and attached an adhesive backing and then diced into individual dies using a diamond etched saw. A solid gold wire is used to connect each chip to the circuit board. Every memory chip Micron manufactured undergoes hundreds of tests to ensure it meets the highest quality standard. All qualified parts are laser marked with part numbers and other identifying information. And in our Micron's remote operations center, or even at the office desk, engineers are able to monitor and troubleshoot wafer fabrication processes without needing to step into the clean room. Hi, I'm Leonard, a process and equipment engineer in web process, which is one of our modules, which I've been inside for more than two years. When I first started looking for a career, I wanted a role that will allow me to make a big impact to the world. Micron's innovations are essential to the development of 5G technology, and that gave me a lot of motivation and sense of purpose, knowing that the stellar work we do is contributing to big improvements in this world. At Micron, we harness big data to advance research, and to achieve this, we use a lot of automation both hardware and software. To increase productivity, we have invested a lot of resources into automating many of its processes to make it into a smart fab of today. So this is the best place to explore cutting-edge ways to be even more efficient. Handling of wafers and tools are mostly remote through our auto material handling system that looks very much like an overhead light rapid transit or LRT. In my background, you can see our remote operations center or ROC, where our operational efficiency is greatly improved using a centralized communication model, resulting in faster decision making and execution. For someone who is relatively new to this industry, my role as a process and equipment engineer was intense when I first started. Much of the learning was done where I tried to work with software for data analytics. But as they say, practice makes perfect. My department has a lot of helpful seniors who contributed to a one-on-one -on -one guide to document issues faced by our engineers so that others can use it as a reference. We help each other get over the roadblocks. And now, even I contribute to this guide. At Micron, it's not all about work. Because I like to organize events, I take part in MYP SG on Micron Young Professionals, which creates events for my fellow peers to learn and bond with each other. I especially enjoy our mentor and new hire appreciation day, as well as cross-site games day. Previously, I've never danced for an event prior to entering the workforce, but I took up this opportunity to learn from one of the introductory courses offered in our workplace. And through this, I got to know more of the dance as well as the dancers. That was very fun. And since then, I've been dancing wherever there's a dance segment for any event. Well, enough about me. So over to you now, Xiaomi. 
Thank you, Leonard. Hi, everyone. I'm Shami, and I graduated last year in 2020 for NTU's Chemical and Biomolecular Engineering degree. I'm currently in my eighth month in Micron, and similar to Leonard, I'm actually a process and equipment engineer. But I'm working on a different module, a module known as Chemical and Mechanical Planarization, or CMP. I actually started off my whole Micron journey as an intern in Micron Fact 10W in the Web Process module. So what did I did as an intern was actually production evaluations and experiments. And in fact, I was actually empowered more like an engineer. In fact, I actually had the opportunity to compile all my findings and present it to senior management that includes both my director and my senior director. During this six months of internship, I was also exposed to be involved in a lot of large scale events such as the opening of FAT10A, an expansion to World FAT10N and X back in 2019. Overall, this actually contributed to giving me a very holistic and insightful learning experience. So what exactly do I do as a CMP process and equipment engineer? It actually involves handling a lot of day-to-day -day production issues and providing process optimization solutions. In fact, when you troubleshoot processes, it involves a lot of learning and leveraging data analytics and industry 4.0 advancements. I'm exposed to new processes and new equipment and evidently it will expose me more to new learning opportunities. Fast forwarding my 8 months here in Micron and I've been involved in more large scale events yet again. So I actually served as a moderator for a ministerial forum as well as a moderator for our diversity, equality and inclusion event or DEI for short. So that being said, I'm actually an active member in our DEI committee known as Mosaic and I'm actually part of the experience subcom. So what exactly does Mosaic do? It's an employee resource group that encourages diversity in culture, race, views and experiences. And how I contribute is to actually encourage and inculcate this sense of diversity, acceptance and inclusion within my conf and me through events and programs alike. So just for your info, behind me is actually a snapshot of my conf gym. And as you can see, we actually have a full fledged gym here in Micron. Now, over to you, Vinita. Thank you, Shami. Hi, everyone. I am Vinita here, and I studied electrical electronics engineering from Nanyang Technological University. I graduated in the year of 2019 and joined Micron as my first job in June 2019 as well. So I must say that, you know, as a fresh grad, I was pretty nervous that how was my first job going to be, but Micron was amazing. They gave me a very warm welcome and it has already been 1.5 years since I joined Micron. Time really flies, you know, when you're working at a great place like Micron, which was ranked as 7th this year. So I'm currently a failure analysis engineer at the Global Quality Department and I have immensely learned a lot of new skills that I didn't learn in uni when I was studying. Definitely, I have to thank my team, my colleagues, my manager, who has been very encouraging and supportive. The first piece of advice that my manager ever gave me at Micron was to think out of the box and to approach new ideas. I think that was something that had pushed me greatly at that time because I got the liberty to follow my instincts but at the same time have the guidance of my seniors, my colleagues. My colleagues are not just my working partners but they are also my friends with whom I can discuss about everything, be it work related or food. They kind of create a family for me away from my home. So I have had probably one of the best experiences of my life while working here in my front sofa, thanks to my team and the family that I have here. Apart from work, I think one thing I have been very grateful about is the ERGs, the employment resource groups that we have in Micron. It allowed me to kind of work on my interests apart from my engineering life, and such as MCing, dancing, community service, I have been able to experience all of them, thanks to all these ERGs. I'm currently a member of the Micron Young Professionals Singapore and a contributing committee member of the Community Outreach Pillar. Over the past 1.5 years, we have conducted quite a few uh, community outreach events and it has been the kind of time which I like to spend contributing back to the community. So like I was saying that, you know, you get to enjoy your interests. So where exactly do I do that? As you can see in my virtual background here, which is the social area, 
you can see there is actually a courtyard right behind me where there's a basketball court there's also a gym there's an msb lounge there is a dance studio as well with mirrors so we have a lot of in-house facilities where we get to experience different kind of activities like zumba and even yoga one thing for sure is that as a fresh grad myself it's been such an enjoyable journey especially because it's my first job, I've been able to experience not just holistic development in terms of my work, but in terms of my interest as well. So this is all from me. Now right back at Mini, who's having a great time at our in-house coffee bin. So Mini, right at you. Thank you, Leonard, Shami and Benita for the sharing on your exciting journey in Micron. Maintaining a successful global footprint includes a dedication to sustainable manufacturing practices and a commitment to supporting the communities where we work and live. I am proud that Micron is consistently looking for new ways to reduce our impact on the environment in a wide range of areas including water management, energy efficiency and recycling. Through the Micron Foundation, we promote STEM or science, technology, engineering and mathematics education to children around the world and address basic human needs through our grants, programs and volunteer efforts. During the unprecedented times of the COVID-19 pandemic, Micron has been and still is committed to prioritizing the safety and well-being of our people while maintaining business operations to ensure achievement of our milestones. Site safe management measures were implemented swiftly, while complying with and often exceeding government regulations. Resources and information are also readily available and communicated in a timely manner. I've also witnessed the tenacity of our teams to adapt quickly and find new ways to collaborate remotely despite the physical segregation. Coupled with the innovative thinking and strong guidance of our leadership team, I'm confident that Micron will continue to excel no matter the challenges that lie ahead of us. So, what is your higher calling? Before we go into our quiz with prizes to be won, let us take a look at how our work in Micron impacts the lives for all. 